Hello everyone, this is Viren and welcome to another fantasy match preview. This is for the game between Guyana and Barbados. It is the first qualifier like you all know and it's going to be a really important game for both the teams. Before I get to the base team for this game, keep in mind that this Guyana pitch is not as bad for batting as it was in the ODI so West Indies against Bangladesh so a much better pitch for batting and now looking at our base team and setup for this game keeping section everyone will go with Gurbaz obviously much better form and batting in the top order Thomas has not been batting at all in most games and unless you see Azam Khan taking the gloves he's not going to bowl either from the batting section Chandrapal Hemraj Kyle Mears and I think the last pick here you have Shea Hope is a decent option and in comparison to the others his form is slightly better but matchups to keep in mind are that Mujibur Rahman has the better of Chandrapal Hemraj Shimran Hetmeyer he's dismissed Shimran Hetmeyer three times and he's dismissed Shakib Al Hassan three times so this will be something very important for you to keep an eye out for as far as Shea Hope is concerned again he might face up to him so this will be a call that I'll take at the end if Najibullah Zadran is batting first I will go with him then in the all-rounder section Jason Holder and Shakib Al Hassan even though Shakib has that negative matchup he can do just enough with the ball to do the job for you unless Kyle Mears or Najibullah Zadran set into him then the other two bowlers Odin Smith and Romario Shepard I'll take both of them if they are bowling first otherwise I'll take one of them and I'll take Rakeem Cornwall then in the bowling section Obed McCoy surely in my team if he's bowling first good Grand League captaincy vice captaincy choice Mujibur Rahman if bowling second good Grand League captaincy vice captaincy choice again will surely be in my team last pick would be Imran Tahir if Gudakesh Moti is bowling second he will also be a good pick in your team but this is the setup for me for now. Some risks that you can take I already mentioned based on the matchup. Shakib has a negative matchup against Mujib. Shimran Hetmai, who I have not currently picked has a negative matchup against Mujib. And Najibullah Zadran will stay in this team if he is batting first. Apart from that, I think as far as captaincy, vice captaincy is concerned, default choices would be Jason Holder if he is bowling first. And in that case, Shakib would also be bowling second. So it sits in perfectly for you, especially if Barbados are bowling first. And Obed McCoy in that scenario will also become a good Grand League captaincy, vice captaincy choice. So this is the setup of my team for now. And yes, we will have a final discussion on this post the toss on the Fantasy Crick Pro Telegram channel. Here's the view of the current team with captaincy and vice captaincy choices. Now let's look at exchange 22 picks for this game. So here we are on the Exchange 22 app and here you can go with just one, two or three players or how many other players you want to buy or sell based on your comfort. You buy when you feel they'll cross these number of points, you sell when, they, when you feel that they will not. Simple as that. Then when you look at who your potential buys are, if Imran Tahir is bowling second at 30, if he takes two wickets or more, that's profit for you. Gurdikesh Moti only at 20. If he takes one wicket that matches your cost and two wickets is double the profit for you right there. Romario Shepard, Odin Smith decently priced. If we feel that they're going to bowl full quota, makes sense. Otherwise, maybe slightly risky. Sell candidates would be your matchup candidates here. Shimran Hetmaya and Shakib if you feel like he's not going to get too many wickets in case he is bowling first. From Barbados, I think Mujibur Rahman at 32 is a very good buy. He's been in too good form bowling really well and same for Obed McCoy bowling first at 32 so Obed McCoy bowling first at 32 and Mujibo Rahman if bowling second at 32 these are my two candidates apart from that no one else that I really see here that I want to buy Devin Thomas if you feel like there'll be a collapse up front for Barbados but super risky pick so this is my setup for exchange 22 for this game attaching the app link in the description you can go check it out right away hope you all like this video i'd like to hear your predictions on who you feel will win between guyana and barbados so do leave a comment below thank you so much for tuning in and do hit the like button before you leave